Daniel, Tiger's neighborhood. <gasps> We're at the pool. Let's go. Thank you, Trolley. Here we go. I can't wait to get in the pool with my floaty. Let's sit over here. Come on, Dad. We gotta get in the pool. Okay, let's go, Sailor Daniel. <laughs> Come on in. Oh, hi, Prince Tuesday. Prince Tuesday is the lifeguard. He keeps us safe at the pool. Hey, Little D. I'm really sorry, but there are no floaties allowed in the neighborhood pool. Oh, really? No floaties? That's right, no floaties. It's one of our rules at the pool. You can go in the water, but your floaty cannot. Ah, well, thank you for telling us, Prince Tuesday. I didn't know that rule. But, Dad, I wanted to play with my floaty in the pool. <sighs> I'm really disappointed. So am I. You know what? It's okay to feel disappointed. I don't like this trip to the pool. Hmm. I know it seems bad that you can't use your floaty in the water, but when something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. What do you think can still be good at the pool? I don't think anything is good. Okay, come on, look around with me. I'm sure we can find something good. <laughs> Miss Elena sounds like a motorboat in the water. Maybe I could do that. Hmm, huh. Miss Elena is having fun even without a floaty. When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. Dad, could we play in the pool without my floaty? <laughs> of course we can. Let's get in the pool together. Come on in, Daniel. I want to pretend to be a motorboat like Miss Elena. Watch this. Did I do it? Did I sound like a motorboat? Whoa, you sure did. Look, Mom, I'm a motorboat. <laughs> Whoa, you're going so fast. <laughs> I like sailing in the pool, even without my floaty. When something seems bad, turn it around and find something good. Being a boat is terrific, too. I'm glad you found something good, Daniel. Me, too. <laughs> Wee!